Hi guys, how are you all? So we have a couple things that we're doing today and let me just tell you, good to have you. And if you're coming back, it's good to have you back guys. But we're doing three things today. One, we're going to be unboxing a PS4, not a pro, just a PS4. I know, I'm finally getting a PS4 for the first time in my life. Two, we're going to be comparing a PS4 controller with a crappy Logitech controller. And three, we're talking about why I'm even bothering getting a PS4 right now. And here it is, the PS4. I guess I should have like made some room for it, but eh, who's got the time? I like to start by saying this is a big box. It probably weighs about two pounds. It's just awkward, you know? The actual PS4 honestly is tiny looking. In that box, I thought it was gonna be way bigger. I was wrong. Oh, that's fun. I like that sexy little thing. This cost me $2.99.99, by the way. More on that in a minute. I'd like to thank Lee Tokes. I really appreciate this help for my Twitch stream, this help for everything that I'm doing. I really appreciate it. I just wanna give you that shout out, man. I really appreciate this support. This beautiful, fresh looking support. So there's like a variety of, there's an auxiliary, HDMI out, LAN port. This looks like a charging port where you plug it into the wall. This looks like where you put CDs in. I heard that the new PS5 is not going to have a CD slot. It's gonna be like straight streaming on that. And then I see two uh, USB plugs for I'm assuming two separate USB controllers. This looks like an earpiece with a microphone. You guys can see that. Like a little microphone with like a little dongle to attach it to yourself. Yeah, that's gotta be what that is. The little earpiece, like old school. This is like, this must have cost someone $2 to make. Oh, I got the Fortnite edition. Whatever, it's what they have. <laughs> it says Fortnite like nowhere else on the stuff. Quick start guide. Nice. I'm gonna need that for sure. Sony PS4 safety guide. Oh, <laughs> who's got the time? Maybe I will read that later. No promises. USB-B, USB normal. This PS4 comes with one controller, uh, wireless, dual shock. <laughs> dual shock for wireless controller. Mm -hmm. Yay! So that's how you charge these puppies, but I think you can just put this in anything. Like I'm pretty sure you could just stick this baby in a little wall charger. And then this is the USB that I personally would be plugging into the back of my computer, into my HD60 Pro capture card, because you cannot just stream PS4 gameplay straight to a PC. No, you need it converted. Yeah, so here we have HDMI. These are both straight HDMI plug. Great! Might I add that I really quite like this controller. <laughs> More on that in a minute. Uh, and then last but not least, we have our power cord. So when I was growing up, my parents never let me have a PS4, a Game Boy, Xbox, but I played games on a PC. So my whole life, I've always played games on a PC. And this is literally my first console that I've ever owned. I know it's not the Pro, but the Pro doesn't do 4K gameplay. It only streams, you know, Amazon in 4K. That's it. The Xbox One streams the gameplay in 4K. I think that one's like $4.99 right now, like $500. Power! Ooh, ready to go to battle. Let's just read the minutest amount of things here. Ah, it's funny, parental controls. Very funny. Nope, <laughs> not for this girl. <laughs> okay, now we're to the part that I really can't wait to do. Comparison. I have this Logitech controller. This thing, see how shiny this is? It's like these buttons are all connected and shiny. So when I'm playing those zombie games, which I do, you know, it's October, that's what you do. I get horrified 
and these things just get slippery under my little sweaty fingers as I'm dying. So that was my struggle. It was just the difficulty of using this controller when my hands are sweaty as hell. And not to mention playing Last of Us, it tells you, you know, use the triangle, use the square. This is Y, X, A, and B. This is not the same format. So when it tells you to use a triangle, it's like, triangle what? It's like you have to know what you're doing already. And I don't. The other controller. It says what it is. Triangle, square, X, and O. Hallelujah. And then this has the swiping pad, so now I can play until dawn. Yeah. <laughs> and generally, these are actually sticky. These little puppies right here. Ruff, ruff. I think I had a boss that said puppies at one point, and now that's what I say. These aren't slippery either. These are grippy. And these are matte, so they're not slick already. They are easier to push. I am really hoping that this does the trick. Have I done it? Have I used this yet? No. Can I hardly wait to use it? You bet you're sweet that I do. Final note of business. Why a PS4? Because next year they're going to be coming out with a PS5. Why not wait for the PS5? So right now, my gaming PC and my streaming PC are the same thing. So when I play Ghost Recon Breakpoint, it freezes my stream. I have to stop playing, restart Streamless OBS, and then get it going again. And it's a huge pain in my butt. And for any streamer that does that, what do you do? Your stream is being chopped up into little pieces and eaten. That's no way to grow, man. With this system, I'm going to be able to do my gaming. Why not Pro? Because Pro only streams in 4K, and that's it. 1080 HD. I'm all good. That's all I need for streaming on Twitch. So now guys, thanks for tuning in. If you had a nice time, subscribe. If not, make sure you leave a really annoying comment. <laughs> just, just kidding. <laughs> but if you enjoyed the video, subscribe, like, comment down below, and I'll see you guys on stream. And I'm going to totally crash this thing now. I'm going to totally play this thing like it, I got nothing better to do now. <laughs>